It's a micro thin line, a true micro thin line. What does that mean? It means it's 20% thinner than a regular fly line. Having a line that lands on the water really gently means that I can pick off fish that normally I wouldn't be able to catch. All of us make poor casts, all of us line the fish. And usually with a heavy thick line, that means that you'll never get another chance at the fish. Not with this line. Being thinner, it cuts through the wind, it makes nice tight loops, and as you can see, it lands in the water really straight. I can make very accurate casts in very tight situations. This particular line has a white overhang marker. That tells me when the optimal time is to make the forward cast. I'm just gonna make sure I release the forward cast when the overhang marker is fully out of the rod tip. I'm gonna make an overhead cast, slip that overhang marker just outside the rod tip, drift a little. Oof, very accurate, very high line speed. Beats the wind incredibly. With that overhang marker there, I can extend it outside the rod tip and make really long casts if I want to. Snap cast. All my lines feature very, very slim welded loops. In fact, the core is exposed here and double back on itself. That means it flies through the rings without any sort of hinging. It also means that the line lies much more delicately on the water and the pickups are easy. Don't think of this line just in terms of dry fly. I use it for nymphing. I've even used it for small lures, things like that. In the UK, Stuart Crofts is a god and he put his name to it. it says it all.